Welcome to Facebook Marketplace Edition, California, Los Angeles Edition of Listings. I'm, I'm joined by Ando. I guess PC hardware is in your recent searches, so let's just start there. Twenty-five dollar Noctua. No, 20, go back. Uh, uh, that. Ooh, wait. Is buy that. that. Fourteen. Buy. Like, are you telling me to buy that? I'm telling anyone who can get their hands on it first. That is a great deal. It was fifty dollars, but they can't sell it. Is there any no mounting hardware? Wait, wait. wait. Comes with, no, it says comes with 11.5x mounting hardware. You could buy mounting hardware from Nakajua for not too expensive either, yeah? Yeah, I would hope so. Is that a car in the, that's yeah. using for the image and is yeah, looking yeah, for Yeah, yeah, he's using, <laughs> he's in a car. This is a Seto rig probably. Oh, uh, uh, what? We suspended your account. If you're in LA, there's always plenty of PC hardware deals. PC gaming kind of exploded out here, so we have plenty of hardware. There used to be only Macs. That was the, that's how it used to be. The only thing used was a Mac, and it was usually overpriced. Free. Clearly free. Nope. It has that's to. Not how, yeah. That's not how anything works. He said it. He said it's free. Zero dollars. Probably worth like thousand dollars, maybe. Well, he, well, they want two thousand. Two thousand. Well, you're not gonna get it. That's for sure. Two hundred and seventy-five dollars for a thirty-sixty. I think that's a no. Hard no. Hard no. Five hundred dollars. You see. Okay, now we're talking. Zalman S4 case, the cheapest case you can get. This is maxed out on fans. That's a pretty nice motherboard for the socket, but with an i3. Was tenth gen i3 hyper threaded? Four four cores, eight threads, right? Comet Lake. Core core thread, so they are hyper threaded. So that's like a, an old i7 essentially. I mean, it's good enough for entry level at least. It's hyper threaded. Would you pay five hundred dollars for this system? No, it's probably more like three fifty ish. Three fifty? I don't know, two hundred maybe. You know what? Two hundred dollars. Yeah. Fifty dollars. Final offer. Fifty dollars. Twenty five dollars. Uh, that's a Haswell level board. Yeah, fourth gen gaming motherboard. Uh, well, it's not a gaming class board. You don't gotta put gaming. Oh, in there. but it's got it's got one of those. It has the copper slug. Copper slug. All you get's the motherboard. Uh, well, yeah. Well, I guess the cheapest price for boards are about forty dollars. So, I mean, if you really need a board. Oh, 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 oh! That oh. that case on the right. That thirty dollar gaming PC case. Oh, that's. That was that was my original case. This this one. Yeah, well, it has a top to it that's gone, but that <laughs> I, I used to have that case. That was my first custom PC case. It even oh, had the, man. It had the California. <laughs> yeah, it even had the state of California on it. <laughs> oh, that cool. was a really good case. I, I would pay 30 bucks for that. I would really like the top to is it, that, though. But is, like, that front, is that front panel a uh, SATA? Um... No, that well, there, there. No, that I think that's like the reset switch or something. Ah. There is a a hot swappable SATA that goes up top though. Let's look up motherboard and CPU. An i7 6700K and this board. Nope, not worth 150. I'll tell you that now. Yeah, it is ITX though, and it's kind of nice. Which raises the price a little bit, but I would say a hundred dollars would be a good deal. Wait. I mean, but. You're you're really limited because you can't upgrade it. No NVMe either at all. Uh, are we sure? It could be on the back of the board or something. Pictures. There it is. Oh yeah yeah yeah. Sixty five dollars for a nine seventy. Oh. Ugh. A real are we sure that's a seven seven fifty Ti? It's it's oh it comes with the nine. That's a yeah AM three plus. Yeah oh, God oh yeah look at that motherboard. Look at that. Is that a rubber grommet on the motherboard? Yep. Well, hey. it's just been laid there. You don't Probably. sweeten the deal with a $10 processor? No, they need the 8350 for reasons. Why is, why is that... Uh, Seven, that 750 Ti. I, why is it on the bottom PCI Express slot? Also, does the I, That's not a 750 Ti. That's because the, the SLI slot. That's not a 750 Ti. Yeah, I was about to say... Uh, that's a, <laughs> that's a 550 Ti, isn't it? It's a 550 Ti. That's a 550 Ti. <laughs> Fake card. Fake card. Don't care. <laughs> Don't care. Oh, you gotta go to Bellflower for it. It might not be you worth got... it just because of where you gotta drive. Oh, oh, ooh, look at those pins. Oh, those are mangled. Whoa. What happened? What the fuck? What did you do? That, those SATA ports are just ripped right off the <laughs> fucking board. Those are no good. 
Did you chew on your SATA ports? $100 for a B450 Elite V2 motherboard. And uh, 16 gigs. And 16 gigs. Of undescript memory. Please tell us your speed and timings. 80 bucks. And the exact board might not even matter as long as it's a decent Wait. B450 board. Oh, it's it's missing the uh, the cooler brackets, and that could be necessary. I don't, it depends on the cooler you buy. Some AM4 coolers require those brackets, like some AIOs just straight up use the clip. But other uh, other coolers, like most tower coolers I've seen, uh, just need. Uh, have but they're nice to X have. Con. They are nice to have. Uh, I've lost them. Yeah, I've had to buy them. Oh, how much do they usually cost? I mean, like 10, 15 bucks, but still, like, even if you just need the screws or whatever in the back plate. I would buy If you're going to use a stock cooler, you would need to buy them. Oh, oh yeah. They come in yellow? That's cool. I would get them just so I can have them in yellow. Retro. That's cool. Looks like those clips would break. I'd try them. I'd try them. What? Oh, video. I think they mean Z390, not Z90 or 3900. Uh, can you show the post LEDs, please? So I know that it posts. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Oh, change <gasps> your fucking battery! Uh, you're gonna unalive in a house fire. Okay. Where? Oh. No. Oh. Oh, messed up. What'd you drop your CPU in there three times? <laughs> There's three different sets of bent pins. You fixed pins on a motherboard before. We could do that. Yes, it. but it's a lot of work and it might not work. Yes. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Three bent, Seda. three bent pins. Oh. Okay. Let's stop looking at broken boards. I like broken boards. Maybe you can fix them and give them a home. Pro don't. I I can't recommend doing that because you'll if you buy a an as is product or anything, you're gonna regret it. You're gonna be wasting money. Yeah, I'll just suck at installing Intel CPUs. What's going on, man? Whoops! Just drop the processor. Yeah. <laughs> Whoops. They try to they tried an AMD processor and push the pens against the other pens ah! <laughs> when the <laughs> processor comes out with the cooler. That's so scary. Oh, look at that. Oh, no. I... Oh. <gasps> it's it's working, but I make it broken. <laughs> Wait, before <laughs> I take it from the motherboard, it's working, but I make it broken. See, pick before you buy. I think someone can fix it. Uh, no, you no, you know why you ripped up the substrate. This is this is a little this is a cautionary tale. Yeah, I've seen this this too many times. It's kind of funny. 8700K, 75, oh wait, 8700, $8, $75. Yes? No. Uh, at some point recently, my brother got an 8700K for about 100, uh, which does have higher base and boost clocks. You would have to be pretty certain you want something like that to max out a 300 series chipset. What's that white angular case down right? 7700k, 1070, 16 gigs. Is that like of an alienware? Oh. It. Uh, ooh. Ooh, kind of. Ooh, no airflow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What the hell is that? What the? F <laughs> it. Who who makes wait, what's these? that little board being yeah. powered? So yeah. You buy USB and a barrel jack. 279 bucks. That's not bad. I mean, that's a really cool case. That is a really cool case. And a 1070 and a, and a 7700K. That's worth it. That's very worth it. Whoa. Oh, I buy power. Look, the SSD mounts in the front. <laughs> for why? I'm trying to figure out the engineering of this. Uh, for it's air? just no airflow. No, there's no airflow. What? It's all glass. Look at that. That's, so you pull the it, top. It looks cool, though. I'd use it. It looks I'd, sick. I'd, I'd daily drive it. Yeah, same. Uh, That's cool looking. It's a spaceship. I want some more cool cases. Oh, yeah. What do we got for cases? Oh, blue NZXT. Oh, what? Uh, NZXT X340. Oh, oh, wait, no. No, it's a 710. Oh, my God, you have so many. <laughs> what? Yo, dude. Asian man packing. Dude, how you wish you could be. $25 each. each! If you buy five or more, 20 each. 
I'll buy all of them for 200. Oh my that's God. worth, that's the price of one. H700, uh. I want three of them. <laughs> San Bernardino, that's not far away. You have to buy one, please. I have Oh, I need a blue MZXT case again. They're so good looking. Oh. Uh. Uh, yes, please. What? Is that a pyramid? I thought it was a D brand thing. Oh, make offer. Okay, never mind. I, but like, what okay, systems in there? That DDR? It doesn't matter. That's at most LJ775. That looks I mean, so it could, cool. It, it, could be wor it could be like a $200 case, but I mean, I'm only gonna... You'd have to really like geometry. You have to be like a math nerd to enjoy that. It, it looks like an old case too. Ooh, what's that? Ooh. Yeah. Ah, oh, oh, yes, please. Oh, no, it's not S340. That is an S340. That's a... Hell yeah. That's a honorable case. From Main Gear. It's, yeah, it's a... It's a good case. Hey, look, a 970 Founders Shut Edition. Shut the fuck up. I knew you were going there. Don't. <laughs> that, uh, the little, like, acrylic cover that shows the heat fins is, like, really dirty or scratched up. That's gross. Okay. An ATI, uh, 250. Not worth it, but... It's a hybrid. That's cool. Hybrid. The AIO is probably... Electric and gas. The electric and gas. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Without a motherboard, those graphics cards are still screwed in. I've never <laughs> seen that before. <laughs> That's so interesting. <laughs> That's How? one way to store a bunch My... of PCI ex Express oh. devices. Maybe you should start storing. Said, oh. Storing them. Though. That's an old card too. See, it's PCI Express, but it looks like it would be like a Radeon like X a thousand or something. Like that looks really old. Look at it's filled with hard drives. <laughs> it's my net. Uh, it's his NAS. Oh, nothing else included. Is that two four eighties? Two heaters. Not for one fifty. Yeah, two little ovens. I, I got two of them for about fifty bucks in twenty twenty. Never did anything with them, which is sad, but I had them. And sold them. People want them? Well, I want them. So people want them. Just for show. Never used for mining. Yeah, you don't have, if you say that, I'm suspicious. So, never overclocked. Oh really? It was never overclocked? Really? Your soup your EVGA superclocked card was never overclocked? It runs at stock speeds. Your factory overclocked card never being overclocked is a little weird. Alright. I'm tired of this. What, what did we learn, Cameron? Everything's terrible. Everything's, Don't buy a computer. Yeah. Sell your computer now and go outside. Touch grass. Touch grass. Play with balls. Play with balls and ass. Okay. <laughs> like, subscribe, bye.